I was really excited to be a part of Central State Men's and Women's Program. And um, at first, the feeling was take a deep breath, and then it was actually enjoy the moment. I'm super excited. Uh, I think the dynamic will remain the same because the talent in Ohio is very competitive. And I'm really excited to be able to coach at the collegiate level now so that I can find the untapped talent in Ohio and hopefully bring them here to Central State. Um, but also being able to explore United States and be able to bring talent from all over here and keep our program. At Summit Country Day, uh, I started in that program and it was a losing program and my first uh, reaction coming in wasn't about the wins and losses, it was about the culture change and making sure that we had um, everyone focused, um, everyone working together and same thing at Baden and I think that contributed to our success is everyone bought into the culture, um, we started from the bottom up and made sure every team from freshman up to varsity had consistency with training and systems. And then from there, we decided to take it a step further each season. Uh, well, if you ask my son, <laughs> who I coach at Baden, he will tell you that I'm no different from mom and coach. Uh, but if you ask some of my former current players, they would say I'm pretty fair coach, consistent, but I also um, want the best out of them. Uh, I don't accept anything less than their best effort, whether it be at practice or in a game. And at the end of the day, whether we win or we lose, we have to move forward. Um, number one cares about their academics. Uh, number two is athletic, but also hungry. Wants to come in to a competitive program and compete and be part of a culture that um, is continuing to grow the game. We're excited to build off of that, um, continuing to find the talent that um, expand upon the talent, I should say, um, that is already present in the program. Um, you know, by the program having the success that it is having, it actually will help from a recruiting standpoint. Um, also selling the campus as a whole, not just the volleyball program, but letting student athletes know what the campus has to offer them from an academic standpoint, I think that will help well, as well. The pressure for me would be to make sure that um, I recruit heavily, uh, number one, but also number two, making sure that I interact and get to know the current student athletes and make sure they understand what my vision is for the program, um, you know, es establish a culture that works for the program, uh, whether it be the remaining culture or shift the culture, um, that's the focus for me initially, but then from there just continuing to grow from the competitive program that's already been established uh, and growing the game. Uh, I attended the game last Friday and I can tell you the energy in the gym was electric. Um, I want students, fans, um, current student athletes to know um, I am here and I'm excited that I'm here and I hope that they continue to be supportive of both the men's and the women's program. Um, come up to me, say hi, I'm very personable. Um, I have the same focus and goals um, that the university has, and it's not just about competing, but it's, it's about being a family, and I want them to understand that, you know, I'm here to help it grow and to help those student athletes excel um, academically, athletically, um, and just outside of here.